A lot of y'all jumped in this bitch quick. Do I got some shit to say? Well. This is an in- this was an interesting episode today. Very insightful as to um how some people feel to feel feel about me. So before we get into it, ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, you ain't watched the episode yet. Jonathan, you watched the episode yet? Well, I'll start with Aura. I see he went live and he had some more things to say about me. Now, I have text Aura. I've sent Aura a voice note. I've DM'd Aura. I FaceTimed him, and then I called him. He ain't answering the calls. Because I'm trying to handle this like a man and stay off of this internet bullshit. But since we're just on the internet. I don't know why Aura feels like I'm talking shit. Because I feel like... I mean, maybe you as the viewers, you guys feel like Aura didn't lose all four rounds. But we all spoke in the house. Right? We had all concluded, you know, like Aura had lost. That's why he wanted to keep fighting. And he's saying that I'm talking shit when I'm literally just speaking facts and not giving an opinion. My last post about Ara, I saw he unfollowed me. My last post, I gave him the first thing I said was Ara whooped you lose ass last in the last round. Right? And then I proceeded to say, you know, what transpired, you know, prior to that, et cetera, et cetera. So for him to say that I'm talking shit when in fact he was doing some of the things that he was doing you know, attention seeking and interrupting people while they were talking and just saying some of the things he was saying, it's kind of like just Aura just being Aura, which is sensitive as fuck. And at the end of the day, Aura is sensitive as fuck. I don't know why he can't just pick up the phone, have a conversation, text him back, and we have a, a similar conversation. It has to be all this like back and forth bullshit, bullshit, because him and I both know we're not about to fight at the reunion. Him and I both know we're not going to get into it. And, and like I said on, on TV, he ain't going to whoop me 